No, he, was, he, was, he was up here. He was up here on the sand. Boss, good afternoon, American 1337. Request IFR to Portland. We have information, Tango. Nobody cares. <laughs> Clear. Am I on the right frequency? Confirm this is Boston Logan Tower. No, you're 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 good. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let let this settle down a bit. We're gonna go ahead and push our aircraft back, start our engines, and then uh, we'll call up for a taxi clearance at that time. Um, copy. Okay, Roger that. Clear for start and push. Uh, we'll contact you in a minute once ready for taxi. Hopefully, um, you've got all the bullshit out of your system because we are ready to copy that IFR clearance, uh, intending to simulate full realism. Copy. Yeah. Uh, Logan Tower, America 1337, we'll push back from Bravo 23, facing North Ace Tour, ready for taxi with Tango, IFR to Portland. Um, Logan Tower to aircraft, man. Uh, that would be America 1337, yes. America 1337, uh, you have IFR clearance. Okay, that's the, uh, I've never been issued an IFR clearance that way, usually we are required to read something back, but I'll guess. No, you don't have to, it's, it's good. Okay, they must have updated some sort of FAA regulation. Yeah, it's, uh, um, I'm actually the, quite startled by this, that code, it's this code, simple. It's actually a, a safety risk. I don't know you what that heard means. Of it? Yeah, no, haven't heard of any of that, but we're going to go ahead and taxi okay. out. Is there uh, any you, runway you, you want us to take? You're, you're kind of yeah. talking at the same time I am. I'd appreciate it if we could sort this out a little bit. <laughs> okay, Is there any specific well, runway, okay. sir? There's uh, a specific runway you would like us to taxi 17. to? 17. There is no runway 17 at Boston. Uh, left. 2 2 left. Okay, American 1337 is taxi runway 22 left. Would that be at our discretion, or are we going to get taxi instructions? I'm quite confused um, as to what's going on here. Taxi as normal. Okay, I'm really not sure what to say at this point. And you're basically giving me free taxi, so I could go ahead and cut across all taxiways is what you're saying, based on that clearance. If you'd prefer to do that, then... And there you go. Okay, roger that. So we'll go ahead and tax the runway 2 to left our discretion. In the meantime, we will be getting uh, some formal complaint paperwork together. Um, you, I uh, that, will have a no phone need. number for you shortly to contact uh, the local FAA administrator, and I'll be filing a report as to... There's uh, no need to do that. I believe there is, because we're no. now taxiing at our very own discretion, and as you'll see in a minute, we are cutting across an entire ramp, because this is the clearance that you issued us. So if we were to strike another well, aircraft, you would be at fault. I uh, appreciate uh, your concern of the other aircraft. Okay, we actually have no idea where we are going. Uh, I believe we're heading the wrong way. We're going to actually cut across some grass here and across another active runway. Roger. Okay, why? Well, I'm not sure why I'm hearing multiple air traffic controllers that are communicating with me at the same time. There should be one air traffic controller, cor correct? Um, yeah, you're right. Well, we need the maximum amount of air traffic controllers because nobody knows what we're doing up here. Quantity is better than, I mean, yeah, quantity is better than quality, right? I do believe I've read that in a fortune cookie before, so yes. <laughs> okay, uh, any other, any, are there any other aircraft on frequency, not tower controllers, but any other aircraft? Oh, this is the only one. Okay, roger that. What is your call sign? Um, Tango Bravo Foxtrot Zeta. Did you, did you say Zeta? Zebra, I meant. Okay, um, what's the, what's the correct FAA phonetic for the letter Z, just as a test if you can correct yourself oh zulu there it is okay roger we're a little concerned with you as well there no and my apologies my hearing is uh mining with my age that's also concerning because certified pilots have to pass medical exams and if you don't have good hearing you shouldn't be in the cockpit <laughs> of an aircraft tower uh, american 1337 holding short 22 left ready for takeoff and it appears we have an f-18 that is on the uh, adjacent runway do you have radar contact on that aircraft um he or not he that is he give his priority over uh american 1337 sure have you had anything to drink tonight yeah i i, I actually had a glass of water okay i'd like to pose that same question to the f-18 because he just did a complete 180 and struck both of his wings off to the side of the runway at this point and is now firewalling the throttles to an open body of water. I assume you don't have radar contact on that aircraft, but getting back on track, we're just trying to get the hell out of this airspace at this point. So we're holding short 22 left, request takeoff clearance. Um, does it look clear? Sir, that would be your job to tell me, because I'm in the cockpit of my aircraft focused on where I'm going and on the safety of my passengers. You have the view from the tower, so I, I believe that would be your, your job to let us know. We are burning fuel here, boss man. And we've got some passengers in the back that are getting quite riled up. We've been on the ground for such a long time, but if we're not able to get airborne soon and turn those fast seatbelt signs off, we are going to have issues in the cabin. 
Alright, well, the ducks have seemed to move along, and you are clear for takeoff. Okay, roger American that. 1337. Okay, roger that. American 1337 is clear for takeoff, runway 22 left. Will that be a runway heading, or do you want us to do a, a direct transition on the raise 5 departure? Do a direct transition on the raise 5 departure. Roger that. Clear for takeoff, 22 left, direct transition, raise 5 departure for American 1337. Clear to take off. Yes, sir, I understand that. You already said that once, and I read it back. Okay. And can you just confirm for us that the F-18 in the in the distance off to the west side of the field did just strike the ground? Oh yeah, that F-18 is dead. And we're just we're okay, we're, you're just going to be okay with that? I mean, each of their own. It, I know it's my job, but he shouldn't have hit the ground. I have to go um, attend to my second job, so this ATC oh, we got, we got will ten be. Minutes. We got ten minutes. We, we need to stop wasting this time. Uh, uh, waste, wasting whose time? Wasting your time. Uh, uh, my time is not being wasted. I've just rotated out of a heavily populated international airport, and I'm looking for ATC assistance. If you're telling me you have a second well, job to attend to while you're within the air traffic control tower, is that second job another aircraft you're talking about, or is that something I'm not sure what you're getting at? Yes. Okay, roger that. We're climbing through 5,000 feet now. We're transitioning onto the raise 5 departure, trying to get the hell out of this airspace as quickly as possible. Could you just, just for the sake of us being able to file that formal report later on, could you specify what your, the second job you referenced was? What, oh, what was okay. that reference um, to? Well, it would require me leaving the air traffic control tower. Okay, and what I, would be I the point of you exiting the tower? Because uh, there's going to be a lot of aircraft that are going to be requiring assistance from you guys as ATC. I have ice cream to distribute. And that is unbelievable, and we will ab absolutely be filing that in the formal complaint to the FAA administrator. So you're saying you have a part-time gig as an ice cream truck driver, while uh, yes, and you confirmed. intend to fulfill your duties of that job while still active as an air traffic controller? I, 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 I fully am uh, going to do that. User because okay, someone important. keeps exiting and entering the channel, and I'm getting slightly triggered because of it. We received a, um, a notification from one of the other controllers who we muted earlier because he sounded like he was channel. sitting at the intake of a jet turbine engine in his oh. microphone. He's asking User me to unmute him. Channel. He might be the real air traffic controller here, so we are going to give him a shot and see if we can restore some realism here. Well, I do believe that is due to your um, piloting skills. Sir, we could turn this plane track. right back around right now and we could butter the bread on runway 22 left and show you that we're way above standard in terms of our piloting skills and landing abilities if you want us to put on I, a demonstration. I completely, I'm, I'm, what I am conveying is that the only reason you're in the air is because you were able to get there. Like I think I lost a, a double digit amount of IQ points after hearing that statement, but you know what, you're conveying a message to us that you're getting a little bit snarky and we are going to cut power and turn back around towards the airport and we are going to put down a greaser on runway 22 right just to show you that we are channel. there's the guy entering and leaving the channel again i got to figure out what's happening here i'm going to unmute this other air traffic controller and see if we can get some more instructions please stand by okay we've uh, unmuted all air traffic controllers i just as soon as i unmuted um the air traffic controller who was muted earlier i heard that same sound that i heard before there it is again. there it is there it is again there's nothing on. I have no idea what you're hearing over. Okay, Roger that. Are you a uh, actual certified air traffic controller? Because I I feel like the majority of ATC I've been communicating with thus far have not are not properly certified. I don't believe they've gone through the training. Over. Okay, Roger that. Just confirm that you have. Affirmative. Okay, excellent. Thank you. We're finally going to try to restore some realism here. Uh, we're descending back in towards the airport. We're going to join the localizer runway 22 right, left approach. We got information tango on board through 6,500 right now, reducing 280 knots on the localizer. We're just going to request a full stop landing so we can borrow the bread show tower. What we could really do with this aircraft. Go ahead with full stop over. Uh, Roger that. So uh, if you could just give us that landing clearance and proper FAA terminology, would be very grateful. Thank you. Land the goddamn plane. Okay, roger that. That is good terminology, and we are getting more professional here. We're clear to land the goddamn plane runway 22 left, American 1337. All right, gear is coming down, flaps extending to 10 degrees at this time. And the one air traffic controller that was getting uh, snippy with us as we were climbing out on departure, I'd specifically request that you watch this landing, because we're going to absolutely butter the bread on the 22 right and show you that we are more than capable of handling this aircraft. All righty. Can I get a wind check, please? Um, wind, uh, 17 knots. 
Okay, what what heading would that be from southeast? Usually the wind check it consists of only numbers, so for most accurate estimate. Um, I don't know. Latitude <laughs> seven two four. Latitude seven two four is not a heading within a three six zero degree radial, sir. Man. Yeah, on. zero to three sixty. Thank you. The one Head gentleman, on. the one gentleman that just corrected him on that. If you could give us a wind check, we would be very appreciative. Going uh. Southeast at 272. Okay, god damn it. You Don't just see. said it was below 360, and then you give me a southeast <laughs> again, so I have no idea where the wind is coming from. It's blowing from southeast. Flowing. Where okay, you are, we're just going to cancel our request for a wind check because there's a lot of giggling, and we've gotten absolutely no indication of where the wind is coming from, so we're going to proceed with this landing. There's no wind. Okay, thank you. When that would just be said is wind is calm. You could have said that five <laughs> minutes ago, and this would all be over by now. Don't sink. Shut up. Or please advise how you like them apples. Hey guys, AirProd95 here. Real quick, I do have some new t-shirts available at my Teespring store. If you're interested, the link is in the description. If you don't give a shit, that's also fine. Thanks for watching the video anyways. I will see you next time. Okay, there's a bomb in the terminal, which we just loaded a full load of passengers from. If we no, need it's... to, we will park this plane right back at the gate. Guys, what the fuck happened? Hello?